Hallelujah. We're glad that we have a God who's bigger than any situation we face. Hallelujah. And he will take our hands and he will lead us through. Hallelujah, Heavenly Father. We're glad that we serve such a great and wonderful God. A God who cares for us. A God who's concerned about what happens to us. And Father, we lift our request to you this morning. We're grateful for everyone bowing in your presence this morning. We thank you, dear God, that we have made an effort to come into your house to honor you. You know the prayer of our hearts. Oh, you know the things that we cry out for you in the night seasons and when we get on our knees, oh God. And even today, we join as a corporate body and we put our faiths together and we say, God, we believe you. God, we know you will answer us. God, we know you will come through for us. God, we know you will give the breakthrough in the Jesus Christ. Lord, we thank you. Thank you for answering our prayers. As a body, we will rejoice. Hallelujah. As the testimonies come in. Lord, we thank you, O oh God, for healing the sick. O oh God, we remember those who are suffering right now. We remember, Brother Mark, come in the name of Jesus. Oh, we pray that you restore mobility to the one side of his body that is affected. Oh, God, we thank you that he'll be able to use his limbs once more and that he can honor you by coming into your house, walking in here. Oh, God, to honor you. Oh, we pray, dear God, for Sister Karen. Couldn't be here this morning. Thank you for touching her. And last week, we got the request for Sister Harris. We continue to pray for her in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, dear God, for continuing to heal Sister George. Thank you, Lord, for touching her. Hallelujah. Thank you that she was able to celebrate another birthday a few days ago. Lord, keep your hand upon her. Remember, Brother George. Remember the children. Be with them in a very special way. Father, we lift up Sister Grace before you. Oh, having two deaths in the family of recent, I pray, oh God, you comfort the family members in the name of Jesus. Oh, help them through this rough period. Oh, God, have mercy. Have mercy, we pray. We thank you, dear God. Remember, Pastor Sharp and Arden away on vacation. Be with them. Cover them under your blood. And then bring them back safely to us in the name of Jesus. Father, we remember our Nazarene congregations, 30,000 and more scattered around this globe. Even right now, lifting up and doing the same things that we're doing. And even that they may pray for us, we pray for them in the name of Jesus. Let your people be lights and examples wherever they are, O oh God, to make a difference in where they are in the name of Jesus. We pray for our Nazarene missionaries around the globe, serving in fields far away from their home. Some of them having their families with them. But I pray, O oh God, that you fight for them. Oh, you'll give them victory after victory, that you'll answer their prayers in the name of Jesus. Father, we lift up our nation of Antigua and Barbuda before you. O oh God, have mercy in our nation. Oh, we call upon you, O oh God. Oh, just a few days ago, we see the thousands on the road reveling and worshiping the God of pleasure. But, oh God, we ask for forgiveness on behalf of our nation. Oh God, we ask for mercy on behalf of our nation. Oh, we are a people that pray and can make a difference on behalf of the nation. Oh God, have mercy. Have mercy in the name of Jesus. Saved by your mighty power. Bring conviction on the hearts of men and women, boys and girls, so that they would honor you and you only, O oh God. Father, we see in the news, and every day the death count is going up. Now it's 80 and more people that have perished by fires in the Hawaiian island of Maui. So many thousands are missing, and so many thousands are homeless. O oh God, have mercy on them, we pray. 
Oh, provide, make a difference, and help the people to look up to you, not to curse God and blame Him. Oh, God, but to turn in repentance. Oh, God, to know that their lives were spared. Oh, God, have mercy and pray in the name of Jesus. We pray, oh, God, you protect us during this week. We do not know what would unfold, but we know, God, that our hands are in your our hands are in your hands our lives are in your hands and you god you god you're bigger than anything that the devil can throw to us we thank you for coming true for us in the name of jesus 